Hey Tar Heel fans, I'm Coach Gunnar Brewer, University of North Carolina wide receiver coach. Today in Coach's Corner, we're going to take some drills and coach you up using some former players such as Dez Bryant, Justin Blackman, Randy Moss, just to name a few. We sure hope you'll enjoy it. In today's Coach's Corner, let's look at distraction drills with receivers and DBs. Here you'll see several drills starting off with the receivers getting side by side between linebackers, corners, or safeties here fighting for the ball. The other guy's bumping them around trying to knock the ball out of their hand. Will you see this use in a game or in practice? As you see, they're, they're uh, making sure that the wide receiver is in the middle here with two defenders on each side, making sure they have a distraction. Here's the same type drill we have in practice as you look to your right here. I'll run it back, but you'll see the same type action right here in the upper corner right here between a safety and a linebacker. You'll catch it here at the end of the tape in the right-hand corner as the receiver runs in between the two and has to go fight for the ball. Good job by him. Again, using the drill to carry over into a game situation. This one, we'll look at the bottom of the screen here. Dez is going to run a, a, a curl route. You're going to see a distraction drill where the DB jumps in front of it, and he has to fight for the ball and find the ball after a tip or the, or the defender runs in front of him, in this case here. As you see, he breaks on the ball, gets in front of the receiver, receiver has to keep his eye on it, makes the catch afterwards. We're working on distraction, so any hands, any body, this contact, we got to make sure that we stay with it. Here you see the defender breaks in front of Daz here, makes the catch, gets upfield. Here we go back to practice here. We're working on crossing routes or dig routes. See the defender staying on his arm and on his upper shoulder, being a nuisance. Here's a little tighter copy of that the same way. Now let's carry it over from there to one-on-ones. Here's Daz running a dig route, a little five yard in. You see the DB break on the ball. You see the nuisance with the arms and the body getting bumped around there. As we carry it, continuing into practice with one-on-ones, you'll see him make a break on the ball here. You'll see his arm come on this other arm of the receiver trying to knock the ball out. We're fighting for the ball here. You see as we come back to the ball and shorten the throw, you see the distraction by the receiver and the defensive back. Here's an example of this up top. You'll see it right here, him coming back to the ball here. The DB jumps in front of it, then the receiver has to find the ball after the tip or the distraction. See if we can catch it on this clip. There you see the break on the ball here in the edge of the edge of the tape. He must make the catch and then get upfield. Here's a game clip up top right here. We have the top with Dez running a, a turn or a comeback, working it. Both both receiver and DB come back fighting for the ball, and we come up with it. A lot of distraction, nice catch, good hand-eye coordination, working from practice to game, making sure we carry it through. That's today's distraction drill.